make you get offended. It is because we will not pretend like you. Do you understand? Don't be me go give them ticket. Don't be me be delegate. Don't be, be anything. Or you see, when they destroy themselves, eh? Now here, we go celebrate them. And when we celebrate it, when we are celebrating it, which is going to not really be cool with many, many of you, eh? And you begin to abuse us, attack us, to my friends here, and like this, we go to do. As you they see with us, we go to pen them. As you they pen them, we go to see with us. Stephanie. So now they have called themselves that, okay, go and find the consensus. Which they will never find. No. They are waiting for a possible step down. But uh, Lawan is still there. They say may the power go uh, south. Meanwhile, Lawan is the guy holding the majority delegates from northern Nigeria. And just like Tambua, if Lawal walked to the podium during the APC convention and say, I am stepping down for Tifnumbu, the setup is complete then. Tifnumbu is going to be their candidate. Then, like I said, to some of you, my Peter, be brothers and sisters, take back Nigeria. I don't even get respect. Eh? Omo Yele Show started take it back. Take it back. Take it back. We heard about that since 2018. Eh? come. Una come put your gra 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 here and there. The oh, Peter Obini is Peter Obini. Is Peter. You can't change it to take back Nigeria. Uh, take back. But you they call yourself again. Take back what? She na take back it. I can't remember. Something like take back, take back something. Is it take back Nigeria? No, it's not take back Nigeria. Take back something. You know, everywhere, anybody, you know, you know don't make Peter be the third force. Eh? Nigeria get the way in, they serve the breakfast. Una, if you no understand that. Oh, Bukwala ma get breakfast. Asikoto ni kanu kuma get here, oto toni. Sumo bilai. Sumo bilai. You see those places, all those places they are opening up, eh? If they, even, even if they keep them open, but I don't think so because now when I go see there, once they finalize what they are doing right now, when I go know who is who I be. All, will happen, all that will happen is just one day. One day. It will just tell you, say, oh, more. They don't make up their mind, say, the power must remain in the north. Oh. And everybody may everybody go vote for the one single northern idea. Una, don't do your permutation well. I like you now. In fact, you know why I like uh, uh, this uh, your Peter Obi movement is that now we na get data, how to work with data. I respect you now for that. Ah, look at this number. Look at that number. If you follow them very well, they have reliable data of what is going on everywhere. Places said that people have people are giving houses in northern Nigeria. Young young people they are giving their houses as secretariat for Peter Obi. But no be swear they work. Once the command comes and said, Bass, your Labour Party member, your this and that, and all of them, they will have to do what they have to do. It is just what it is, my brother. When they do data that uh, Atif could score 11 million, and that 11 million, 7 million of that is from Peter Obi's influence. Now, don't even do the charts. Peter Obi will score 22 million. APC will score 11 million. I'm sorry, APC will score 15 million. Uh, Atifku will score uh, 11 million. No, don't do everything. Perfect, all of that. And within just two weeks, INEC came out and said the level of uh, voters' registration, both in the north and south, in the last two weeks, make I give you the figure, they said over 7 million people don't register in two weeks. Because the, the moment Peter Obi joined Labour Party and all of them everywhere, in northern Nigeria, in southern Nigeria, out of this over 6.5 million people we don't register in two weeks, eh? Peter Obi effect, they call it. Listen, oh. they said 
over 4.5 million are youth alone. So that gives credence to the Peter B movement. So they now believe that the young, young people can deliver more than 20 million votes for Peter B. And Atifku is going to be struggling. PDP will be struggling in distant third. Because according to them, since APC is going to pick their candidate from the South, eh, the whole vote is divided. But the young, young people who are not voting for party, they will just vote for Peter B. That's the permutation. Very smooth and straightforward. They have proved it. They are, they are recruiting people who are converting uh, from all over Nigeria. They are joining the Peter B, this Peter B, the Labour Party. I'm serious. It's real. Okay? They are everywhere. And they are not just doing that. They are also registering people to vote, to vote in the North, in the South. I've seen it. Okay? I've seen it. But that is not... Oh, let me... Should I say... If you witness the answers, the first 20 days of answers were light a lie. Eh? In fact, people got motivated to the point that all over the world, we did our own answers too. Yeah. Thousands of people came out in America. Tens of thousands of people came out in the UK. All over the world. Maybe you remember now, Canada, everywhere. Answers, answers, answers. It's a big movement. You see this Peter Obi movement now. They don't make and look like that answers. People where they do crypto, people where they do uh, gen coin and all of those things, eh? They are already chipping in money, chipping in money. From abroad, though, they are already doing Peter B movement and the rest of that. But when uh, the system came crashing on the answers uh, movement, T, we can't think, say, nah, that thing go trigger. If the government try anything, I know how many of my friends that we, have, we were having chat and they would say, if government try, if government need to be very careful with this issue of uh, answer. So, if this government should do mistake to go and use soldier or anything, you see this youth, you see these people, the whole world is watching. Oh, the whole world is watching. Oh, you see this, uh, they, they, will, they will shut down Nigeria. Buhari is gone. I had people who are saying that uh, Buhari, the end has come. APC, finish, forget it. So, when they brought out the soldiers, when they started the massacre, the whole world just watches in horror. Ha! Ha! Are they killing them? Ha! Why are they killing them? Ha! This is un unbelievable. Ha! This is this and that. The following day, the government just issued that uh, everybody doing answers, they are, they are, they are terrorists. Oh boy! Everybody who has, who, who's been like, I, I may, you know, we need our country, our great country, our country, we must fight. The youth must, this and that. People started deleting their picture of answers. Ah, some of the people, some people who are answered said this and that, they have declared them wanted. They have canceled their visa. They have declared that they have closed border. They have closed their bank account. Or more, people who were like, everybody started deleting everything. I saw it. I saw it. Because if not, when they were killing people for answers, eh, you would expect that they turn out. With the way the whole thing lasted for that 20 days, yeah, ah, you will never believe that eh, they could do. Buhari was shaking. He was begging. All over the world, we were doing answers, 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 and this, and that. Oh, when they bring gun out, declare everybody terrorist. People will be say that they enjoy themselves. They are doing fine, fine girls, fine, fine boys. See. Answers, answers. Some of them would love to, to go on holidays here and there. When they got to the airport, they realized that DSS is looking for them. They couldn't sleep in their houses. They started crying on, on social media. What kind of country is this? What kind of country is this that you can you cannot even express yourself as a citizen? And people, strange people have been, have, have been calling me. They said they will kill me. They said they saw me at Ensas. Hey, I'm just a citizen. Uh, Nigeria, that's Nigeria. Those who could run away before they close the border, they quickly jack up. They come they do activists from abroad, like Mayegu. Activist. I've told you, I'm not an activist. I'm not, I don't call me activist. I know they fight for anybody. I they fight for myself. Fight for yourself. So in the process of saying you, they fight for yourself. I they fight for myself. Now so we go meet for the fire fighting field. Now so we go become friends. Say who you they fight? And Nigeria, hey, hey. who you? Who you they fight? My Now the same Nigeria system. Oh, hey. ah, okay, yeah, now we fight together. Now so we became friends. Oh, I know they fight for you. I'm not fighting for anybody. I am fighting for myself. 
you will fight for yourself. And now that we are fighting the same enemy, the same rig system, that's how we became friends. So not they look at me as, a, as somebody who they will be activist too. I know be your activist too. I've said it many times anyway. The person where he die for all of us now, Jesus Christ. The next person will say he won't die for 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 his own people now, and the Sunday go. Sure, you get me now. Don't be say that if you no come or maybe may that come die. But if I won't die, I won't die. Say I they defend my dignity. And I can die as well with Teddy and my fellow fellow Yorubas who are ready to defend their own dignity. But don't be say I won't come, come die for you at the grace. Die for you. On top of what? If you are ready to fight for yourself, if you are ready to die for what you believe in, then we can be friends. But Mayegun, you are our leader. This Mayegun can die for... I'm not in Namdi and I'm not Sunday. Look at me very well. We should be grateful to them, by the way. We should be very grateful to them. They brought the soldiers. Pa, 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 pa. Almost everybody everywhere quiet too. That is why I'm saying that, uh, don't worry. I don't like to be the prophet of doom. At the same time, I don't like to pretend that uh, what I know, I don't know them. So it's that uh, you wait for the system. When the system sets you and the finalists discover that you are actually a threat. You are a threat. In this, uh, in the next seven months, eh, when I go open my mouth and say, ah, how can they say something like this about Peter B in the north? This is not good. No be APC go attack your Peter B. Eh? The foot soldiers are the ones who are there with the bed sheets. A whole king size bed sheet over their head. The gummy of this world. They don't like him fidelity. You see all those ones who are joining you from northern Nigeria. Eh? Now they catch cruise in it. Once they say, Bismillah Rahman, you know, 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 everybody go just march like that, like zombie. Hello, Peter Obi, Peter Obi. Hi, hi, obedient. Tamporoba, shake it, shake it, shake it, dance here. Tamporoba, tamporoba, ah, comrade. Esprit de corps, comrade. Peter Obi, obedient, obedient me, obedient you, obedient us. Now, so you go know. If you know, care, they go say, oh yeah, bonam, blasphemy. Ah, blasphemy for you, comrade to comrade. I'm telling you this. But again, on a day too sure, when on a day inside that your emotional, emotional roller coaster. Nigerian youth, Abi, emotional roller coaster. God damn it, nobody will stop you. Now, when you can't do this, this, this emergency scratch. <laughs> so, what's it happen? So we don't they call you sins. They don't kill everybody. We don't they call you sins. Say, may you break, may you break, may you mash break. You know, mash break. See her now. You don't jam roadblock. That roadblock is Nigeria. It is the system, but you will know it. Sometimes they say experience is the best teacher. Yeah, it is. I believe. Sometimes if you don't let me experience it, if you don't let me experience it, I probably will never believe it. That is why me, I am not the kind of person that will tell you, do this, do that. No, you don't have to. I, I mean, you will do it what you will do. Maybe if you listen to me, you know, we can just be wrong together and we can be right together. But when I see this, when I see right, black, I see white, I tell you, this is white, this is black. Don't come around and tell me that it's gray. I say, eh, I'm saying when you mix them together, Baba, this is white, this is black, okay? Then when we get to the stage of a secondary color, then when you mix them, you can tell me which color. Don't make, I beg you. That is me. And in this case, so when they finally, if they finally now give their ticket to the South, I don't care whether they give it to an APC. There is also a secondary fear. Is there ever going to be any election at all? Is the insecurity in Nigeria will make them conduct one? And at the same time, yeah, 
Is that power actually coming back to the southern Nigeria? Is it time we tell? Oh, Benny, there's no time that he's telling. Just look and smell the coffee. Look inside. Read the room. If you read the room, you will know that, uh, eh, Baba? Except if you want yourself to continue to be played. I am not. If Numbu, then shook him, then shook him, then knock him like that. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Shook you. You know. Knee, knee on his neck. When they kneel, uh, uh, what do you call it? On uh, Tifunubu's neck. What did he do? He screamed out. He said, Orile de Yoruba. Ah, Yoruba nation. Look, we Orile de Yoruba. To. You have, I mean, you did have a conversation with uh, Bokwari about uh, Yoruba nation. Now, this is the door. Now, now they have, they have left you. Even wrote to twerk, eh? Uh, to okay, wait till we talk about. Even wrote to, even wrote to twerk self no day. Wrote to Aso Rocky no day. Yeah, you think you can please others and displease yourself? Now they have left you. That's Tiff Numbu. Now they have. Where's that thing? I'm, I'm gonna go look for it. One sec. Seventy years old man. But, Charlie boy, but this ain't Charlie boy, so I'm mumu don't too much. Charlie boy, now you're mumu, now too much. You be mumu. You think say they wise. You are a mumu man. You are a mumu man. Tiagasa. Yes. The Tiagasa. He fell. He fell dead. He passed out. He passed out. Seventy years old man, but when their people came, <laughs> sorry, the, the Tiaga Sam, Vitam, even wrote to two XF no day. That's the Funbu. So let's see how their consensus is going to be. Since now that uh, they've managed to get her back to themselves, like oh yeah. Give it to us in the south. Yoruba nation. Yoruba nation. Hey, all of you who actually like, I think you can mock people or laugh them off and all of that simply because of what they are promising you inside the APC and others, right? Don't worry. Like Tiff Numbu said, I will be back home, which means he will come back to all of you. And when he is back, when I go come pick on something, and that is Yoruba nation. No, they said Devulumayi stepped down for Lawan. Devulumayi is a governor from Ebony. And he said he didn't step down. I don't know, maybe this is the clip they are talking about. I want to commend you for doing so well in Ebony State. In fact, uh, when I saw, when the president uh, paid a state visit and slept in Abakaliki. Was it a two day? Yeah, two day. Visit. Visit. The president proved something that Ebony is home of peace. And it made it possible. And from what I saw, in fact, when they showed some of the project, I thought they were bringing them from somewhere outside the country. <laughs> they look so good. Commitment of someone who is devoted to serving his people and you have done as proud as a political party and we pray we pray that whoever is coming to take over from you will continue where is he? I was looking at your work and I wish you were back to you have a regular job you have a regular job the shoes are very big. You are also tall. <laughs> I felt your feet will also be big. So we wish you the best, but you have done us proud, Your Excellency. And uh, with this, I want to once again thank you for bringing us. Mm -hmm. So, from what we have heard, yeah, without putting you in any limbo, the Tifnumbu's gang 
if they are unable to make Pastor Ruga to step down for Tifnumbu today or agree to step down for him at the, con at the Congress or something or convention, this is going to make it official that uh, APC is bringing their tickets to Yoruba land. That is going to be a lot of a mixture of this uh, of this news when that happens because like i said it is a greek gift and i would rather like i said i don't have any say in it too. i'm saying that i would rather they should be fair enough now that they feel like uh, the power should go to the south abby i don't even know why i'm asking them to be fair but in my own way then this is the moment they should give it to the Igbos. At least they won't say they don't have a Igbo presidential candidate. For the sake of your own Nigeria, not that I really care. I don't. But they won't do that. Whatever, whatever they, 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 they choose to do. Once they tell you who is going to be that candidate, yeah? Or should I just even put it this way? If Pastor Ruga did not, if Pastor Ruga does not uh, step down for Tifnumbu eh, tonight, then you can begin to look at uh, Pastor Ruga Lawan ticket. Lawan is going to step down for somebody. Lawan is the person holding the Northern uh, Block uh, delegate vote, and it is it is strategic. It is deliberate. Lawan is running for president at the same time. Lawan uh, Senate uh, press, I'm sorry, Senate ticket is waiting for him in his state as you are watching right now. Yeah, they already put somebody there to hold the space for him. He's just holding the, he's the one that is they are sending to that uh, convention as the delegate of the north. He's going to hold that, that thing to that place. Now, the shock idea is this are they going to? give all this southerner in APC the wicked treatment since Wari said, okay, I support the south. Normally, all of the northern candidates in APC should have automatically stepped down. But this one is not. No, it's not. In fact, we have been told that uh, so many, I mean, some of these uh, aspirants from the eastern Nigeria are going to step down for him. And that was when the news of uh, Devulu Mahi came. That uh, Devil Mayi is stepping down for him. But guess what? Devil Mayi said no. He's not stepping down. Well, they said he said no. But cut the chase. The time for political uh, brickmanship or political political games is, is I mean, sorry, political uh, uh, business is now. Tiffany Boost dollar money are already in Abuja. And good enough. They are happy. They said they should go to the field. Going to the field means they will have a map of all the delegates and the, those in charge of them, and they will need to start allocating money. As we, as we have been told, the people who collect, the person shall collect smaller for that Abuja from tonight is going to be getting over $20,000. No joke. Money is going to rain. Stolen money. And people are advising you, if you are one of the delegates, I beg you, make sure say you take uh, all this, you take this uh, marker, currency marker, or better still, eh? Go and buy yourself a counting machine that can discover fake money. So as they pay you your delegate money, your dollar, you can quickly check if it's fake. Because those who went for PDP uh, convention, who got paid in dollars, some of them went home, they regretted because they got fake money. Monetized politics. Some people were even saying, Mayegu, is Pastor Ruga also going to pay delegate or bribe delegate or they are just going to vote for him in the name of Jesus? I said, uh, ask him now, Pastor Ruga. Pastor Ruga, are you going to pay delegate too? He said, no, 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 no. We are just going to vote for him in the name of Jesus. Uh, please vote for me in the name of Jesus. Of course, Pastor, I will vote for you in the name of Jesus. So the bottom line is this. Don't work yourself too much up, okay? There's so much to look forward to. You see this one they want to do. 
It's just for them to finalize all, uh, every other part of uh, uh, the puzzle. Okay? And then they will present themselves. Then uh, you and I eh, will begin the work of telling every Yoruba son and daughter, don't be part of this. And let me tell you this as well. You see that publicity that we have been doing and so many other pro uh, programs that we are bringing on board in order to reach out to our people, support them, if possible, distract them from the lies of this APC, of all these uh, paid sellers, all these hungry slaves retarded their slaves like that, or these I mean, slaves are uh, obedient fools. They are paid peanuts to go and lie to their fellow uh, brothers and sisters that if Nubu is going to be this or that, or APC is going to be this or that. So in the next, I mean, the coming, uh, in the coming months, should I say in the coming weeks and months, leading to their fraudulent election. So we want to get involved to tell our people never to be part of that. Don't, don't, don't listen to them. Don't waste your life. Don't go out there and start uh, campaigning for something that will kill you. And we don't want to say it to them just by saying it to them. So we're going to get involved. We're going to distract our people. Our programs, our, our, you know, our, our programs, let me put it that way, they will distract the people. Enough of them to rubbish every other thing they are trying to do. That's going to be our own contribution to 2023 election. I'm not going to tell you not to vote. To. See, me, I'm not one of those that will tell you no election, no election, because I know the law. And I'm somebody who always believed that uh, where my own right stops is where yours starts. Or where yours stops is where mine starts. Mine can't override yours. And you can't, split, uh, you can't speak for the public if you are never elected to do so. It is your right if you want to vote. It is also your right if you don't want to. It is your right if you want to go and campaign for votes. It is also your right to campaign for not for votes. Yeah. You can tell people voter boycotting election is also part of electoral process. She be Tifnumbu and gang believe that uh, the slaves in Yoruba land will always kind of uh, listen to them or follow them. Our job is to help those who have been working for years to expose the raw the, the criminals. And the gang of all these political crooks in Yoruba land. But they have been silenced. They have they don't have the resources to really pull any, any kind of a shocking uh, uh, you know, surprise. We will pull that surprise. We will distract the people. They will not get the support they want. Oh, come on. For now, it's a free for all. It's a free for all now. Everywhere you go, ah, this you see all their billboard everywhere and all of that. You are also going to see us everywhere too, telling the people, right? The reason why they should never be part of this. Rather, prepare themselves for something better, bigger. And we'll do all of that through the same publicity, not guns or anything. I don't like threatening people. I'm somebody who doesn't like, even if you begin to talk to me right now, and what you are saying, you begin to make some level of a you know, threat. If you don't do that, you will see what will happen. If we do, if all of us don't do this, eh, they will just, I don't like that. It, you don't talk to me like that. Even if you mean well. I don't like you talk to me and tell me and threaten me that if I, I mean, if people don't agree with what you're saying, then whatever they see, they should take. I don't like that. So I don't talk to people like that. Do you understand? I believe that uh, consent is so, 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 so powerful. And when you get people to say, yeah, we will do this. Yeah, we want to do that. It is much, much, much effective than making yourself look like uh, you have control over anybody. There are people who feel like they have control. Yeah. You see all the politicians, when they talk, they talk like they have control over everybody. I don't like that. Nobody has control over anybody. I don't have control over anyone. Nobody has any control over me. And nobody will, ever. And since I'm somebody who will be like, no, you can't talk to me like that. You can't, you, can't, you can't talk to me like that. I mean, I'm somebody who will tell you that. I will say, no, don't talk to me like that. So if that tone is a threat of the kind, then I'll be like, oh. or if you want to abuse me, yeah, I will know that we are abusing ourselves. That's different. I won't tell you not to talk to me like that. Or you don't talk to me and say, I want to help you. I want to, you know, I am very smart. I know this, this, I know that. Now listen to me. Come on, shut up. Don't talk to me like that. You can tell me that too. 
if I'm talking to you somehow and you feel like, no, my ego, don't talk to me like that. And I'll, I'll quickly apologize that, oh, I'm sorry. That's why I don't talk down on people. That's why I don't tell you what to do. But I can be very, 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 very persuasive. People have told me that. Yes, I can be very persuasive. By, you know, point by point, I can make you agree that, well, it is the right thing to do. And that is the power of persuasion. I love that. And the power of uh, order and all of that. So, yeah, we are going to be everywhere. We are going to encourage people not to be part of uh, validating this charity. And we're going to do that in the human is, I mean, what do you call it? In the peaceful, or let me say human and peaceful most ways that we can. You can tell us that we are slow. You can tell us that uh, we don't, but no. You see, this method, this, this, my method, my ego, the persuasive method, I have been told that it is working. And I want to keep it that way. I want to keep it that way to a day when we would have distracted more Yorubas. And when we say, come out, let us face them, they won't feel like you are commanding them to. They will see it as a necessity and something they have to do. And that is why we said that uh, to do all of this, we are going to need our own resources. Our own resources will go th through the people where we will engage them, we we'll talk to them. Politicians come and talk down on them, promise them this and that. We won't promise them anything. We will tell them to hold our hands. Let's hold hands and stop this local terrorist that we call politicians taking advantage of us. And they've sold off, I mean, sold, sorry, sold us off to Nigeria, except we take ourselves away from them. We will never, ever experience anything good for you. So if you can make people see that, and we are able to like uh, be in their lives too, go to do a market, Yoruba, I mean, Ilera, Yoruba mission, all these programs that are coming, a coffee, Fuawa, Motoni Lore, Nile Yoruba, funded by us, the Yorubas worldwide. All these ideas are to make sure that uh, the Yoruba nation, that Tifnumbu said he went to discuss with uh, Bokwari, and Bokwari still rubbished him and about to completely disgrace him. Are you with me now? So that Yoruba nation that he said he discussed in private with Bokwari, and then come strangle and strangle and they won't disgrace them because they talk them in public. We can make all the Yorubas in Yoruba land say them in public, not in private. We have to give kudos to all of our, uh, you know, our people who have been working for years now, sensitizing the Yorubas, why we need Yoruba nation and all of that, yeah? Going to schools, in fact, spending money to get all these messages to the remotest, the, 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 the most remote uh, uh, part of a uh, Yoruba land. We want to appreciate them and we want to support them at some point too. Yes, that's what we should do. If we can take ourselves, our people away from the likes of uh, 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 Tifnumbu, Pastor Ruga, Bewiri uh, Danielio, Amoso, and all this uh, PDP APC. If you can take our people away from them, and you give them an alternative to actually worth fighting for. You would have done your job. That's what I want to do. And that's what I encourage you to please join me. It's not going to be about talking. It is going to be about uh, acting and doing. And when we say do it, eh? I mean, come on. We are not the type that just talk and talk anymore. On my Egun's diary, political, we can call you can call us at the talk and do. We talk and do. My Egun, now talk and do. He talk, he do. On the temple of truth, then be talk and do. Then talk, then do. That's what we do here. We talk, we do, we do. So I want to appreciate every one of you who actually joined me this morning for this uh, Sunday sermon. I just want you to know that uh, as the breakfast is cooking, even, uh, you see, let me put it this way. They told them to go and bring consensus, the consensus now just to further expose their greed to all of you in southern Nigeria. They are not going to come out with any consensus. Okay? And Tifnumbu is now being dragged with the people he said he made. So whatever it is, whatever comes out of their charade, we have seen that of PDP. We have seen that of a Labour Party, Pitaubi. 
We have seen that of my very good uh, person and brother, Omo Yele Shoure. He won in court. Shoure that started a political party from scratch. And he thought he had the uh, people of like minds around him to promote something that the young people should probably embrace, free themselves from the shackles of uh, political slavery. Yeah? His own friends. Let me be that guy's name again. Leonard. He supposed comrade versus comrade do spread the call. That's why I won't join your politics. I've told you many times. Look at me, eh? It is so easy for me this way. Life is so good. The only problem where I get is say Nawala, Nigeria Wahala. And why is Nigeria Wahala troubling me? Because I have families there. I have very, very loving family there. I have friends. Okay. And now I'm beginning to have partners, people I actually do business with from here. But apart from that, eh, Nigeria Wahala, if you remove them from my own uh, dictionary, I don't get problem with any of your whatever is going on in that place. Life is easier. Life is peaceful. Okay, I can track my progress. So are many other people um, out there. But one thing I want you to know is this that they if they if they break Tifnumbu's the art this week, that's not the end of it, you know that. And now that they have defeated Tifnumbu, what is he going to talk about? Ah, Shuri what is Maegun going to talk about? Is it not that you should be praying that uh, you don't become a breaking news and I will talk about you? Because I will just use you as an example. For other other worries, we know the hear what. Yeah. If the Fnumbu die, and people like us still there alive, we will still be talking about him, referring to him, say Akutukwe or no, no, Ajimobi, Ajirebi died. Today, every time they are praying for Sheyima Kinde in Oyo, the pensioners, the students, that they drop small small equi to Ajimobi, even though he don't die now for how many years. So I'm saying it to you right now that uh, our effort to sensitize the people, to encourage and uh, to tell the truth to the people, to show the people why Nigeria is not working, why it will never work, as long as we continue in this uh, trajectory. Showing it to them, yeah, it's n it has nothing to do with uh, whoever comes out as their candidate or not their candidate because it's not going to end there. You know that. Yeah? Whoever becomes their candidate, that's just like uh, the last part of the puzzle to put on the table. So that means whoever it is, then you can now be able to go and tell people, tell, say, Shoto, you see them? I'm saying it to you now. We don't give a damn for real about who become their candidates. We just feel like uh, as in they destroy themselves, yeah, we can help them start counting. One down, one down. Okorocha, one down, one down. This other one, down, down. Who are those ones who are still active? Which are which of these atomic bombs is still active? This atomic corrupt criminals still active. We we'll monitor them until they destroy themselves completely. Or until the people sum up the courage, the strength, eh? To take back their lives from them. So it is a continuous thing. It is not going to end. Ah, and I like the candidate of APC, Sha. Thank God it's not Ifnumbu. At least, at least I like the ah she chama sasie. You know, we say they are juju, they work on you. Eh? At least, uh, you know, uh, I, I, I mean, I, I see, I mean, I'm happy. I see prefer that uh, it's a uh, pastor Ruga. At least it's not Ifnumbu. Chama sasie. She won't she won't sasie by. You know, my casa is more. You know, we say they don't they don't they don't they don't they whine you. I mean, are you the whine us? Don't go to catch any feeling, oh. No. Do you understand? I respect a PC or more. They don't give them to an Igbo man. Let's see, they worry you. You will catch feeling. Can't they, can't they explain to us why later? Don't they do that, oh. Don't they do that, oh. We know they do that here. Okay? We know them. And we know they are chameleons enough that. Uh, Make you know they let them chameleon your brain, oh, because some of you are actually those who set yourselves up anyway. The system is rigged. Okay? The politicians know. And it is because it is rigged 
That is why the system will never clear credible people. And that is why you only be given the option of uh, rogues, criminals, recycled criminals, repentant terrorists. Then you go for them. Then you turn around and say, hey, God, I beg you. We don't go vote for this one again. No, say what's up? What's up? Mama Okoro, what's up? Hey, God, I beg you. What's up, Mama? We just say this one go there different. Oh, you don't different. We no tell you. She we no tell you. And you the catch feeling. What the catch feelings? The catch feelings, eh? Now heart breaky. Ask all those our, our beautiful sisters out there. I tell you, say even if uh, they won't catch feeling for you, they go they, they go down. They see some some level of collateral. If everything, if the love won't burn, and go get something, they go call collateral. I say, well, at least I did that because of that. So now I don't lose. I know they lose. You cannot do any business with these corrupt politicians. So no matter what they put forward you, yeah? Now you go lose. Me, I don't discover them. See, you know the game. Ababa, see, me will collect that thing, Jare. Me will collect whatever they give to us. Uh, now, now, so that they do. You say, me will not collect money for, from them. Could not collect money from them. If they get there, they know they, they, they go still lose the money. Now, our money that they give us, me will collect her like that. Me will collect her like that. Oh, my. I will the wrong belly. No collect anything. You know they collect anything back, Baba. That's why I was saying it last time. I said, run, no. Run, no. No, they catch, catch emotion, no. Stay focused. Say, Ross, focus. Focus, no. Once they finish with their shenanigans, we are going to put all of them on the table. Whether not Tifnumbu, whether not Pastor Rugao, even whether not Judas, hey, what do you say they call her? The Ubi Ma Judas is Karioti. Rotif me, Amechi. Even if it's a, whoever they give, anybody where they give, we will bring them on this table. We will tell you the truth. If you go catch feelings like you did in 2015, can't they tell God, God, come and touch the heart of our leaders? God, come and touch the heart of our this and that. We don't care. Maybe I should even say it better to some of these uh, dumbos that usually ask me stupid questions, by the way. Yeah, I've got so many dumbos here too. There are some, there are some, there are some dunderhead here. They have been, they will tell you, I've been following you, my for the past five years. But the weirdos will still come and ask me. And then which who, who should we now vote for? Choriel Tibaji. Who do you want to vote for? Eh? Oh yeah. Che, you don't get your own PVC. Oh yeah, now Besita. That is why we'll bring all the thieves back to you. I don't really care. Yes, I will celebrate it here when they disgrace Tifnumbu. Or is that it? There are many, many others that are still going to be disgraced, destroyed. Then, then those who are the uh, crumb beaters, vuvuselas, uh, ass lickers, crumb chasers, eh? all risers, the humble slaves, obedient, full, sophisticated, all of them, eh? When they scatter, when they scatter, we we'll begin to grab them and say, Come here, come back here, let us check something on you for 16 years in no normal. Come here, we will do deliverance for you. That is what we are doing. Che na me go give her if no tickets in Abina, you go give her. You be delegate. Abi you be Bokwari or any of them. We just want to come and say, oh, that it don't happen, no. Because we know it's going to happen. Sooner or later. So if it happen quick, quick, that will save you. We go, we go just, we go just laugh at you for a few days. Eh? After a few days, we we'll continue with the leftover. Whoever they left, we we'll face them. Yeah, we face them. It doesn't cost us much. It is to liberate the minds of those of you who are their strength, their mouthpiece, simply because of uh, what they have done to you. So which of them they want to give me that I can't treat uh, their issue? They give us uh, Tifnumbu. Ah, you. It's just, uh, it's, it's, you know, the calamity, the, the destruction. You don't want your children to witness it. Ah! What if they give us, uh, if they give you Tifnumbu? I mean, we say we could get a lot of uh, video where we could, we could make you feel like, say, hey, leave him, hey, leave him like that. Finally, we could just stay here, they take you the mock. People were told me then that uh, 
God will shame me in 2015 when I said, you won't bring the jihadist. You know, they follow Tifnumbu Uli to go and bring a, a, a murderous uh, killer, a, a Pukwari. They told me then, all of, all of them, most, well, most of them are no longer with them anymore. Shut up your mouth. Buhari is going to be the president. There's nothing you, got, you are going to do to it. Of course, now what I won't do. I won't be part of those that your, your soldiers and police will be using. They will be using to train how to shoot, shooting target. Pa, 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 pa. I won't be part of that. So it's your choice. You will live in it. What I'm doing is that uh, can you at least, eh, at least, even if you have, uh, even if you have uh, already uh, shiori bruku forever, yeah. If you have children, if you have family, she you no know, love them, ni. Eh? Even if you have been so, I mean, if you have become so unfortunate that this much, eh? At least they get feeling small, small. Say so no, be only you. They same way you they do. There are consequences. Here you get if you don't care about yourself, care about your children, care about your family members, care about people that oh, then they with you, right? Family, I said, family member, I said, care. Oh, they are part of you. Oh, now they do on your mandate to get. Oh, okay, I understand. Anyway, well, I just feel like it should be human. All those things they are giving to you, eh, they have consequences, okay. And most of them, they are deadly consequences. So make you feel like human small. Maybe everything be mouth, mouth, mouth. What you want? Chop, 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 chop. I'm just advising you. I want to go and monitor what happened in Ondo. Today's sermon is done. And I'm saying it to you right now. Get ready. Be prepared. I mean, be prepared, yeah? As a Boy Scout. Always be ready. Oh, you are seeing Tinumbu tissue, right? But it is going to be an expensive disgrace. I'm going to go shell the whatever they brought from Lagos. I'm going to share them, share them. Let's see how many of them their money can buy. And if all of you remember, we were a week before, the, before their own PDP, I mean, PDP primaries. It was everywhere. Money go make you feel like, say, who will you be? Who them be? Let them come. But uh, the GRD North then go humble you. When they are humbled, my brothers and sisters, we will come back here, come celebrate. But for now, thank you very much for your time. Thanks for sharing this. Thanks for the like. I mean, like, and the, well, have you actually dropped your offering, by the way? Have you? Lenny Sunday. You still want to leave this program without dropping your offering? Without liking the video? So how, how many bases do you hold right now? If you say, oh, then you don't don't drop that. And I'm going to see you later tonight. Uh, inshallah. By the special grace of God. I want